um, if I were going to, you know, advise my younger self, uh, I mean, everybody uh, on the call, everybody in the audience who's listening to this, I mean, you remember what I said earlier, I'm listing this whole thing where I'm like signing up to work all these jobs at the NSA, to the CIA. Um, I volunteered for the U.S. Army at the same time everyone else was protesting against the war in Iraq. Um, and the reason I did that was because I believed what was on TV. I believed what the president was saying. Uh, you know, I drank the Kool-Aid. I came from a federal family. I was taught that the government was fundamentally good. And I still believe that the government can be fundamentally good. Um, but I have realized um, through my experience and through discoveries of the fact that the private truths known to and held by governments are often very different, and in fact, we're completely the opposite of their public statements and public promises, their, their claims of a duty and sense of obligation uh, to the public, what those happen to be. Uh, that tension there is, is the teachable lesson. Um, I should have paid more attention. I, I didn't because I, I simply had faith. Um, I was privileged. I wasn't impacted by any of these policies. Uh, most of my political understanding came from, you know, Hollywood movies and culture. Um, and the reality is, if you're always portrayed as the good guys, uh, you begin to believe that you are the good guy, particularly when you start to associate with them, particularly when you get, you know, secret handshakes and top secret clearances and polygraphs and all the fun accoutrements of being, uh, you know, on, on the inside. And I was sheltered from the kind of hard political thinking because of the fact that I worked in technology. And this is what's happening in Facebook today. This is what's happening in Google today and Microsoft today at Amazon today um, is we begin to see the same kind of awakenings that, that I went through as a young man beginning to be replicated in a new generation of young people. Uh, because the reality is uh, all work is political work. 